Hi, I'm Liz Need, and this is another segment of the Inspired Vision series. I want to talk to you today about bumps and bruises. I have a daughter, she's 11 years old. She's my heir apparent, she likes to take risks, and she's a super physical person. I think she's an amazing athlete. But I do have an issue sometimes, and I realize that I need to get over it because she's always hurting herself. She's always bruising herself up. She always has a goal. She wants to do a back walkover. She wants to walk on her hands or learn how to kick her soccer ball a certain way, whatever it is. And in her spare time, she'll work on these goals. And in the process of doing it, she always hurts herself. She'll be, try to jump from one place to another, or she'll work on her back bend and kick her feet over and hit something with her foot. And then we have to deal with the ice and we have to deal with tears sometimes and band-aids and, and all of that stuff. And there are moments when I say, why are you always getting hurt? It makes me crazy. Play it safer. But the reality is, the reason why she's such a good athlete and the reason why I admire her so much is because she understands that you have to experiment and try different things and risk bumps and bruises in order to achieve your goal because she can do a back walkover. She tends to be able to jump from one place to another. She figures out how much strength she needs and how to hold her body. She can walk on her hands and she's going to do a million other things with the goals that she set out to do. So I thought, what a great lesson for us as we go through achieving um, success in our business and trying to figure out a way to have the happiest romantic life possible, raising our kids, or facing physical challenges as we get older, that you can't worry about being perfect and you can't worry about bumps and bruises because if you take risks, there are going to be bumps and bruises. There are going to be moments when you don't do it and falling down or falling short isn't an indication that you should stop. Sometimes it's just a place for you to learn, pick yourself up and try again. Have fun with it. Take a little lesson from my daughter and just stay focused on it. Don't absorb all of the failure and the stress. Realize that a little bruise is actually a sign that you're out there and doing something and that it's a badge of honor because unlike everyone else who's sitting there trying to be perfect, you're out there really doing something. Bumps and bruises, they're actually a sign that you are growing and moving and that you are just moments away from achieving something really cool. I am proud of you and I look forward to a bunch of bumps and bruises in this next year.